What's up, YouTube? What's up, YouTube? Can y'all hear me? Okay. It's C. I'm the Don, and I am back with another video. So, today's video is actually going to be a cooking video. Like, what? <laughs> you know, because I'm Chef Boy or D with a pot boy. Like, yo. Okay, so. Can y'all guess what I'm making? Got some hamburger meat. Got some tomato paste. Got some sugar. I got some shredded cheese. I got Mexican cheese and I got mozzarella cheese. I probably should have just did freaking cheddar and mozzarella. But it doesn't matter. Um, got me some red cayenne pepper. And I got me some chili powder. And I got me some gourmet nacho cheddar cheese sauce. I got two packs of chili seasoning mix, but I think I only needed one. And I got some hot dog buns, of course. I got these because ain't nobody about to keep buying um, four or $5 juices when you can make some cool light. Yeah, and I got some smoked sausages. Okay, y'all, and I got dessert, no lie. A 7-Up cake. I haven't had one of these in years, and the last time I had a 7-Up cake, it was so good. So, I got a 7-Up cake, too. Um, So, yeah. But, y'all, child, 50 fucking dollars for all of this. $50. 50 fucking dollars. Like, 50 dollars. Fifty dollars, fifty, forty dollars. Like y'all remember that from Baby Boy? Forty, like for what? Fifty dollars. Like I didn't even get nothing for real life. Okay, I did get one more thing. Let me show y'all. I got this chicken teriyaki, um, teriyaki chicken meal kit. I love teriyaki chicken. I'm a sucker for teriyaki chicken. And I'm like thirteen dollars. That's basically what I pay at Panda Express. So I might as well get the whole meal kit and have my own teriyaki chicken. Okay. I'm just like, god damn. What is that? What the? Like, come on, $50. I didn't get that much shit for $50. Okay, so, like I said, we're gonna make some chili cheese dogs. What I'm about to do right now is I'm about to um do the, knock these dishes out. Cause I can never, like, I can't cook in a kitchen that ain't fully clean, like 100% clean. So I'm gonna finish washing these dishes. I'm about to finish washing these dishes. And, you know, yeah, I gotta finish washing these dishes, y'all. So I'm gonna be back. We about to get, we about to get to it, y'all. So what's up, YouTube? It's C on the Dine. I'm back, I washed the dishes and I am ready to cook. So first thing first, I'm gonna make my chili and I'm gonna boil my sausages. Should this be big enough to boil these? Okay, so I, why my pot look a little dirty? Okay, so we finna, I need to boil some water first. First things first. So we gotta get some water in here so I can boil these hot dogs. I keep saying hot dogs. I did so smoke sausages because I don't really like hot dogs. Unless they're all beef and the store didn't have any beef. So boom, here's my water boiling. Hold on. Got some water boiling. Here's the smoked sausage that I'm going to use. Right here. Where does kitchen scissors go? Okay, listen. If you ain't motherfucking cooking, don't be touching the motherfucking kitchen scissors. I think that should be a universal rule. Why the hell is the kitchen scissors disappearing? And I know who did it. I do. So the water ain't boiling yet, but oh well. So I'm going to go ahead and get a pan out while I wait on that. I'm going to go ahead and get a pan out. Oop. I'm going to go ahead and get a pan out for my hamburger meat. I'm going to make my chili from scratch. Um, yeah. I'm making my chili from scratch. Okay. Here's the hamburger meat. Do, 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 do. Okay. 
Mm -hmm. Boom. Go ahead and throw that away. Oh, let me, I like to put a little pink Himalayan sea salt in my water while it boils. Just, I don't know. I don't know why people do that. Put salt in water when they boil it, but I always do it. And I actually like to use pink Himalayan sea salt. I like that better than real salt personally. So yeah, so I haven't turned the burner on for my chili meat because I want my hot dog water to start boiling. So let me show y'all. Let me say, well, me personally, hot dogs, chili cheese dogs are not something I just eat all the time. Especially since I've seen that video that they said it's like human meat. Like, you know, they surveyed all the hot dogs and how so many hot dogs had like freaking um human meat in them. I was like, mm. like, ugh, not cannibalism. No, that's them trying to prepare us for it. So they can say, well, hot dogs have human meat in them. And I have to have been eating them for centuries. Like, you know, but still, and even if it ain't true, that's enough for me not to want to eat them. But I was craving chili cheese dogs, so I got some smoked sausages, like I said. So yeah, I've had chili cheese. I haven't had a good chili cheese dog in a minute either, so I can't wait. And I, this is my first time making the chili cheese dogs by myself. Look. All right, y'all. I'ma um check back in with y'all when my water gets to boil. I go ahead and show y'all. So that's my water for the hot dogs. Is you know ain't boiled yet. Got some pink Himalayan sea salt in there. It's not crumbs or nothing. I got my hamburger meat right here that I have not started doing anything to yet because I don't want to cook it too fast. I'm just gonna wait. I'm just honestly waiting on my water to boil so I can put the sausages in there. I mean, you don't have to do that, do you? Because it looks like it's starting to boil. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw them in there. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and throw them in there, y'all. I don't know why I'm waiting for the water to boil for me to put them in there, but. I mean, do you do that? See, that's why I don't like doing cooking videos. Because y'all probably like, this boy can't cook if you got to ask some shit like that. I can. It's just like, you know, you be wanting some reassurance sometimes. A little closure. A little second opinion. But, you know, I um, I can't. Now, like I said, I haven't made hot dogs in so long. I can't remember if you just put some water in there and throw the hot dogs in and let them boil. Or if you wait till it's boiling to put them in there. I really don't fucking remember. But I can cook. Matter of fact, while we waiting on that, I'm gonna make some Kool-Aid. It can be cold by the time I eat, yeah. Hold on. Okay, boom, we finna make some Kool-Aid. So if you never made Kool-Aid, I'm gonna give you a rundown. But honestly, I gotta read the, okay. I ain't gotta read no motherfucking instructions for no Kool-Aid, I'm from the hood. Quit playing with me. So here's that, okay, so I'm gonna show you how I make my Kool-Aid, boom. So I get a picture like this. I get me a little packets. I got some lemonade and I got some tropical punch. So what I like to do personally, now you gotta smack them. Let that sauce get to the bottom. I mean, that's that, that juice seasoning. I call it juice seasoning. Just make that up. You gotta let the juice seasoning get to the bottom. So boom, you're gonna put it in there. And if you really wanna be fancy, what you can do is run this to the sink, just like this. Boom, watch this though, but watch this. Y'all see how it poured out red? Yeah. But that's if you really wanna get fancy. You know, you just wanna get all the juice seasoning out so your juice is really juicy. So yeah. You can even rub it along the sides if you want, get all that flavor in there. Boom. Okay, so then you wanna get your other packet. I'm gonna do lemonade. Okay, go ahead and rip that off the top. Go ahead and get your lemonade in there. Go ahead and get your juice packet in there, your juice seasoning. Boom, so I got that in there. Boom, and like I said, it's gonna be fancy. Boom, make sure you get all that in there. Boom. Okay, we're gonna use a measuring cup. Hold on. So now, you wanna have you some sugar. Y'all see the sugar? Okay, you got a cup of sugar. I got a cup. We gonna put a cup of sugar in there because, and I'm using a measuring cup because the old me would have just got the dump in this bag in there. But I ain't trying to get a hell. Of, I ain't trying to get nobody sugar diabetes. You know, I'm. You know, I care about every. I care about the health. So that's not even a full cup. So. Okay, a cup 
maybe even a half a cup just in case, just to taste. Boom. Okay, so now you wanna, um, oh, that looked like a good slushy at the bottom, y'all. Look at that. That looked like a, mmm, it smells so good. Mmm, this smells amazing. Now you, I'm just adding some water to it. You add how much water you, you know, scale it on the water, you know, scale it. Got your Kool-Aid right there. Y'all see it. So now what you wanna do? After you get to this step of the water in here, now you wanna get a spoon. You about to use this, a whisk. You wanna make sure it's nice and stirred. Then you wanna taste it. See how you, you know, if you got enough sugar in there. You don't wanna taste too much cause you gotta taste something. Okay. Let's see if I got enough sugar or if I'm going to need more. Nine times out of ten, I'm going to need more, but let's see. Oh! They need them a little bit more sugar. Just, you know, because, come on. Maybe just a little more sugar. But I think that is really good. Like, hold on. Where my little whisk go? Y'all, my Kool-Aid busting. I better start selling like Kool-Aid cups. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, I'm playing. I ain't about to sell no damn Kool-Aid cups. Hold on. Boom. Perfect. Let's get motherfucking back to the cooking. Okay? So, boom. My water boiling. Boom, let's go ahead and put these smoked sausages in there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Boom, clean as you go. Let me throw my trash away. So I'm gonna go ahead and start um, chopping my meat up while, you know. All right, y'all, so. I got my meat cooking, you know, browning my meat right now. Got the uh, sausages boiling. So I'm going to catch back up with y'all. Hey y'all, I'm back. So my meat is starting to brown. So far, I don't know if you can see, but I did put a little pepper on there and I know you can't see the salt, but I didn't want to put too much seasoning just yet because popped on me. I didn't want to put too much seasoning just yet because like I said, I still got to add my chili pack and some other seasoning. So just salt and pepper to start. Okay, so I'm going to finish this meat off. The sausages are done. So I'm going to go ahead and turn those off because I am going to put them in my um, cast iron skillet to let them get, you know, almost like a grilled taste. This is like my favorite skillet. Like I only have it on three and it's cooking so good. This is a Rachel Ray skillet. Hold on. I love Rachel Ray. I used to watch Rachel Ray with my great grandma when I was a kid. When I'd be at her house, she used to watch it. Used to watch Rachel Ray. Rachel Ray still come on TV? Cause that was my girl. Like I know some like Paula Deen, like yeah, I knew Paula Deen, but I'm Rachel Ray was my girl for real. Rachel Ray used to throw down. Me, I used to be looking at some of her food like, okay, Rachel. I need to go over there. I need to go over right to your house one day for dinner. Ooh, that's what I'm gonna do one day. I'm gonna make a cooking video with Rachel Ray. Watch, watch me. Tell Rachel Ray in the comments. Tell her see on the dawn when I make a cooking video. If she won't, I know Martha Stewart will cause she's for the people, okay? All right, y'all, so boom. Got my cast iron skillet going. We about to go ahead and add the glizzies so they can start browning up. A boom, one, two, three, boom. So we gonna let them get a little brown, you know, like they just came off the grill. So now we can go ahead and I can start my chili. So I'm gonna go ahead and add my drained hamburger meat in there. Boom. I'm gonna add my tomato paste now all right now i'm gonna add some water so i just went ahead and filled this can up with some water maybe do two of them then add the chili this is turning out like that looks amazing 
Zing. Hold on, y'all. I'm about to add a little chili powder to it, a little cayenne pepper, cayenne pepper, a little garlic salt. Boom. It's all about the seasoning. And then this is my favorite seasoning. I put it on everything. A little bit of this. Hold on. Let me lift this up. I put this on everything. I love me some slap your mama. Now we finna stir. Only thing I forgot to put in here was like some onions for the flavor. But I'm not a big onion person, so I actually don't care. I'm gonna add a little more water. And now I'm about to show y'all, now we about to do, but you know, you know, you know, it's the debate. The sugar going chili, the sugar going spaghetti. I'm gonna add a little sugar tomorrow. I'm gonna add a little sugar now. Added my sugar, stir it up again. You know, I'm gonna turn the pot down on simmer. Let that simmer a little bit. Now, here's the motherfucking taste test. Hold on, because I gotta taste it before I, you know, finish it off. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Boy, hold on. Hold on. There ain't no reason I motherfucking snap like this. Oh man, I need to make me some motherfucking chili. This shit's so good, I wanna put some, I wanna eat this right now like it is. Okay, y'all, that chili sauce busting. I did my shit. I did my best shit with that one. Okay, on to the next. How good these motherfucking sausages look like, come on. Okay, y'all, so now what you wanna do is go ahead and get you a pan. And what you wanna do with this pan is you wanna put your hot dog buns in there first. I already got my oven preheated. Go ahead and put them in there like boom. Like that. It, I'm just gonna eat two right now, so this is just for me. You wanna get you some nacho cheese like this. Ooh. All right, you wanna go ahead and put this at the bottom. Okay, so boom, y'all see how I got that? Boom. So now you wanna go ahead and put the put this in the oven. We're just going to leave that in the oven for about maybe until it melts, until it starts to melt. So that could be five minutes, it could be three minutes. I think I have my oven like on 375, so it shouldn't take too long. But you just want that in there so it can start to melt. But wait, we're not even close to being done yet. If you're enjoying this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Yeah, show some love. Okay, y'all, so boom. boom. So as you can see, the cheese has melted. So what I'm going to do is now I'm going to go ahead and put a bun, I mean a glizzy in there. Now we're gonna add some chili sauce on top. Boom. Now we're gonna add some shredded cheese on top. So I like to use the Mexican cheese. Okay. Now I like to add some bacon bits on top. All right, now we're gonna put these back into the oven. We're gonna add these back into the oven, y'all, just like this for a few minutes, just to let that cheese on top melt and boom. After that, we're gonna be ready to eat. So stay tuned. Look at how good them look. Hold on, hold on. Mmm. The finished product. So now we gotta put these on a plate. And we got to eat. So let me get these on a plate. I had to kind of rig this up for y'all to see it. Okay, hold on. What is a chili cheese dog without jalapeno peppers? Mmm. Boom. Now it's ready to be eaten. Okay, y'all, it's time to taste them. Mmm. 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 Oh my gosh. 
Hey, this is Sunday dinner right here for me. It is Sunday, November 26. Y'all should see this sometime in December for Vlogmas. Mmm. 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 Look at that cheese dripping. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. I snapped. Mm. Hold on. Mm. Hold on. You ain't finna break on me like that. I ain't ready yet. Mm. Hold on. They keep trying to break on me, y'all. Mm. 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 Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm in chili cheese dog heaven right now. Mm. Mm. Oh, shit. Put that jalapeno pepper back on there. Ooh, y'all know what I want to put on this one? Ketchup, man. Y'all know how when y'all be eating and you start getting hot. Mm. Mm. I'm hot as hell right now, y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed this cooking tutorial. Let's see y'all on the dines. Chili cheese dog with homemade chili sauce. Don't forget to like this video, comment, and subscribe. Mm. Cause right now, I'm about to make some love to this chili cheese dog. I'm about to savor every last bit of this chili cheese dog. I don't plan on saving shit. Mmm. Mmm. Then you gotta lift the plane. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Can I get a guy that's good all the time? Mmm. All right, y'all. I'm gonna see y'all later.